Hello everybody, this is David. Uh, welcome to another two minute tip. I'm going to try to keep this one in the spirit of two minutes. It's going to be a little bit longer, uh, but we have a lot of things to cover. So I got a call the other day from a teacher whose district was uh, moving away from Google Docs and uh, she wanted to be able to learn how to move her files from Google Drive to OneDrive for Business. And so it gave me the idea to go ahead and create this quick video. Uh, this is making the assumption also that you have already used the Google Drive app, so you've synchronized the Google Drive to your your PC, and you also have used the Sync app for OneDrive for Business. So you've got that installed, and you see uh, both folders in your in your file explorer. And so this is going to walk through that process uh, with that assumption. Uh, so to get both of those, you should be able to do that pretty easily. The sync button in, in OneDrive for Business and also just using the Google Drive app to get that folder created on your, uh, your PC. And the purpose behind doing some of this is that you want your work files to stay in your work environment and you would like your personal files to stay in your personal environment. So moving your files off of Google Drive into OneDrive for Business helps you do just that. Now keep in mind this also works for things like Dropbox or if your district has a network folder that you want to move bulk amount of files into OneDrive for business. So let's go ahead and get started um, in OneDrive. Uh, you can see here I've logged into the Office 365 account, click, clicked on OneDrive, and uh, created a folder in here just for organizational sake so I know where those files from the Google Drive uh, docs came from. I did it by clicking on New and uh, new create a new folder to, to get that going. Uh, you also see here the sync button. This allows you to do that or create that folder and it also gives the option to download the correct app for your device um, when you are to, to in order to create uh, that file on your file explorer on your PC. Um, and you can also see here the upload button. That's where you might do individual files uh, dragging and dropping one at a time or selecting a few at a time. Uh, but what we're going to do now is we're going to minimize this window and we're going to go down here to my task menu and I'm looking for the Google Drive app first. So I want to right click on it and open it up and when I right click on it I'm going to see a option to open Google Drive folder. And once that opened up you see the files that I've got and I want to go ahead and uh, hit the Windows key and left arrow to snap that over to the left. It's an easy shortcut to be able to do that. And then I'm going to go down and open up the OneDrive folder. So I'm going to find the OneDrive for Business uh, application and I'm going to right click on it and select Open OneDrive for Business. And that's also going to open up. So now I have this window active and I just click uh, press on the Windows key and the right arrow and that snaps my window over to the Right, so you can see I have both windows selected, uh, or both windows open, one side by side, and I've got my files here with under Google Drive, and then I can go through and just select the individual files that I would like to move over to the uh, Google Drive folder, and you can see if I look over here on the right hand side, I can see the Google Drive folder that I created in uh, the online environment. Um, right there is OneDrive. And then I can click in this blue space here, and just drag them over to that folder that I pre-created and release the mouse. And you can see now it's actually moved those files out of uh, the Google Drive. And you say, well, what if I want to just keep some in the Google Drive and copy them over so I can uh, still have them in, in two places? That's fine. Just select the file that you want to move. In this case, I created a file folder uh, just to show you an example of, of moving or copying a file folder. Then right click on it and select copy then go over to your Google Drive uh, folder that you created or the folder that you created to hold those files and right click again or hit control V and then paste and that will place that file and you can see the file is now in, in both places so it kept one copy in your Google Drive and the other copy is now in your office or your OneDrive for business folder. So now we're going to go to the uh, website where we started all this to Office 365 or OneDrive for Business. You can see here that the little green uh, check mark is marked next to those files, let you know those files are synchronized. When I go to the site and I click on the folder that we created earlier, uh, you can see 
that inside that folder is all the files, are all the files that uh, we selected and moved over. Uh, remember, if you're doing this uh, with a large number of files, they won't necessarily show up all right away because it takes a little bit longer to synchronize, uh, but they will, as long as you're online, keep uh, moving up to the cloud once that's done. Uh, remember, this is great to keep your personal stuff personal, your work stuff work with Office 365 and OneDrive for Business. Um, and the fact that you have a terabyte of storage, which is a massive amount of storage space to be able to use. Uh, hope you have a great day, have a great school year, and hope you use this in your classroom tomorrow.